she came home. Carlisle's lost an empire. You fall hard enough, you tend to be reminded of what truly matters. So, the end of the line. You ready for this? Are you? Who will you be without a score to settle? <laughs> I guess the world's most wanted fugitive will have to do. Alexa Carlyle is dead. According to the funeral invitation, that is. So naturally, it caused quite a stir when the late matriarch turned up at the breakfast table, alive and kicking. Carlyle, wisely sensing that her number is up, has emerged from exile to tie up loose ends and secure the Carlyle legacy. She may be a monster, but you have to admire her due diligence. Carlyle descends from an ancient line of warrior aristocrats. Her great-grandfather made a killing in the Second Opium War and established an empire in shipping, railroads, and newspaper publishing. While largely unknown to the public, the family still asserts its quiet dominance over global transport and logistics, media, and technology. Most senior of the partners, Alexa Carlyle, is cold as ice, tough as nails, and sharp as a razor. Incidentally, it was her late father who first brought the three families together after the end of World War II at this very house, meaning that this gentleman is the birthplace of Providence. It began here, and it ends here. Talk about poetic. One more thing. According to our intel, Carlyle keeps a case file on the constant, information that may be helpful in his recapture, so don't leave the estate without it. Right. Happy hunting, 47. See you on the other side. Thornbridge Manor. The Carlyle family's home for countless generations. The revenant Alexa Carlyle and her three adult children, younger brother Zachary, grandson and daughter-in-law, are all gathered to conduct Carlyle's sham funeral. Curiously, Carlyle summoned a famous London PI soon after arriving this morning, but his purpose at Thornbridge is yet unclear. Now, the target knows that you're coming, and her guard detail is top-notch. So Mr. Gray will secure their nearby field HQ and intercept all calls going in and out of the estate. Any appeal for backup is going to fall on very deaf ears. Good luck, gentlemen. Whitmer, private investigator. I have an appointment with Madame Carlyle. Please wait. Mr. Whitmer is here to see Madame Carlyle. You can go right in. That is Phineas Whitmer, the famous private investigator hired by Madame Carlyle this morning. I'm curious why he's here. Maybe you should do some detecting yourself, 47. Roger that. Go! Questing assistance. We got a situation here. Command, command, you there? Someone's killed a lot of people. JHQ, I have nothing to report from my current location. ETA at ex extract in seven mics. Control, out. I'm wrapping up the incident. Over and out.
whatever. I did not sign up for this. So 41 guests will attend a funeral tonight. Wait up, who are you? Do I know you? Why aren't you listening to me? Are you deaf? Hold it, Ron! No, no! Ah! <laughs> And I have nothing to read. Buddy. Someone, please help me. Help! Hey, last warning, asshole. Wake up! Something's very wrong. Someone's messing around in a serious way. Okay, I'll take a look at it. Thanks. Never. Please, God, somebody help! Got another disturbance. Investigating now.
Pressure here, guys! Help me! Fire at will! Fire at will! Moving, set, 20 meters, 11 o'clock. Keep pressing. Exactly as I said. Yes, yes. Peeling off! Oh, trap tied off the team. That's Madame Carlyle taken care of. Time to get the file on Arthur Edwards. Visual on Tango! Move your line position! Let the blast go back! Shift! Lift! 